welcome back to my channel it's been a long time uh, but i am back with amazon return palettes i'm not sure if everyone follows me who's watching but if you do on instagram i've been playing an awful lot on about amazon return palettes we have been buying a lot recently and we have just filled the van today so i'm gonna get it all out well we're gonna get it all out and then we're going to show you what we've got. If you are interested in getting involved in the Amazon return palettes or getting one for yourself, do drop me an email. I will leave my email below so you can always message me, ask me any questions you have. Um, I'm sure we can sort some out. Okay, so palette number one's all done, all off. Getting palette number two off now. Unfortunately, we don't have a forklift or anything, so we've kind of just got to like take it all out one by one. Um, but it's keeping our steps up, so it's not really an issue. Um, some of this stuff is actually bought from people on Instagram. So bought by people on Instagram from us. So again, it's just stuff that we buy for them. They send us the money, we sell it for them. They get their profits. Number two looking okay? So it's part number two all unloaded and here. So if we have what we've got, we've got a lot of hoovers, uh, actually a hell of a lot of hoovers. We've got vaxes, we've got breezes, we've got the actual hoovers, they lose. I hope that's how you pronounce it. The one here. They're all kind of at the back there. And 99% of the time, the hoovers work. So I'm just going to cross my fingers right now and just make sure. We've got a radiator. We've got a frying machine thing. Crock pot, slow cookers. A lot of the boxes are unnamed. So we actually don't know what's in them. Um, a lot of the fryers. Again, something that we will have no idea until we open it. Handheld hoovers, we've got an iron. We've got a Tassimo, nice. Got quite a few different things. We have a lot of steam mops, but they normally, we do get quite a few of them anyway. Another hoover. Uh, let's have a look. Grills. A multifunctional electric skillet. This is our third one we've had actually that week. We've got a ninja food cooker. But I'm not too sure if it's broken or anything because it does seem like it's been bashed around so but they are mega money if it works so fingers crossed and again another slow cooker so we've all picked up today we're gonna have it all we're gonna check it all over now and then we're gonna start listing it so for the people who have actually bought it off us we list for them unless they want to come collect or we deliver to them it's not a problem um, and we just charge 15 pound a week for doing that um but yeah so we're gonna have a little look over and just see what's what see what's working anything not working we have a guy who comes and collects all the broken stuff and pays us for them so we're never actually out of pocket um anything that is working we put on marketplace and ebay and a lot of them we do sell to our family and friends as well so we've landed quite lucky there so we're been testing everything now it's all we've got left to test everything uh, a couple of coffee machines. The coffee machines I'm going to take home because it's just so much easier to try them at home. Um, the crock pots, I've had a few of them in this palette. Not too sure what's in these random boxes here. We've had a couple of these and these are all been working. That's broken. So this is our broken pile. And anything that we're going to send to an electrician guy and he just pays us £5 or something a piece and just takes it off our hands. This testing that's going in um, on eBay soon. We've got a Hoover in here. Stuff like this we don't really hold much hope for because the way it's packaged. Again, no idea what could be in this. Oh, a Russell Hobbs slow cooker. Got a couple of steamers. We have so many Amazon basic Hoovers. It is untrue. This is just scrap. So like, this has come without a tube like Hoover thing. So we're just gonna bin that. 
Uh, that's another bit of scrap. This is actually a kid's toy which come on. Um, doesn't work and is broken. And then going over here, this is everything that's been working so far. So we've got a couple hoovers here, coffee machine over there, handy hoover. We've got a couple of blenders in this one. This is actually really cool. It's like what you put plates on the side. Didn't even know. A hot water dispenser, we've had two of them. This heater, brand new, works brilliant. Sand mixer. So this is actually broken on this. So we've just taken it out. We're gonna advertise it without the lid, if you will. Um, another grill, we've had a couple of George Foreman grills. One broken, one not. I don't know what this is. Milk frother. Uh, we had a couple of toasters, like at the back of there. See? Not sure what else. That's it from here. Um, we've got another air fryer we just found. We'll test that soon. This new. Oh, this we've got two of them. Wow. Yeah, Both new. Wow. Um, some guys collecting this shortly. This is a steam iron. That works, but I'm going to retest it after because I'm not 100% sure. But like, it makes funny noises. That is where we're up to on this pallet. We haven't looked at what type of like profit we're going to get back yet. We're unsure. Um, as we're still testing. So yeah, it's been quite a big pallet this time. Stuff like this really intrigues me because I just no idea what could be happening. Uh, let's have a look. My chins. Some sort of blender or something, I'm not too sure. So I'll have a look at that in a minute. Nothing that's coming home with us, the pallets, that coffee machine. So that is all of the two pallets that we had ordered. Um, we're getting some manifests and we're going to get some more over the weekend. Quite exciting. We're going to try and fill these up. Obviously, it's coming up to Christmas now. So we're going to order a toy one and some shoes and clothes. Um, I sell all my stuff like that on Vinted and it sells really, really quick. Especially before Christmas, so I need to like bomb it on right now and then get it all sold before Christmas. It's a perfect time of year. Um, the appliances are going really fast as well, so I'm guessing that's all, all sold because of Christmas. So yeah, I would recommend buying Amazon return pallets. Well guys, we are now on our way home. We're going to go and list everything on eBay and Marketplace. This normally takes about two to three hours depending on like what else we've got to do. Um, as obviously we've got three kids between us, so we are also parents. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna go home and do. Hopefully we all can get three to four grand in profit. This is our fingers crossed. Um, a lot more work this time than in the previous pallets that we've had. So we've kind of got look at the last two pallets we just bought. Uh, we are gonna start selling our own tested pallets. So if you are interested, do drop me an email below and we can get it all sorted for you. Um, obviously where you can end up with a hell of a lot of fit as well um, any interest in the actual pallets or any information that you would like to know my email is below again just message me and we'll sort something out um, me and Jordan just do this quite a lot we're, Sorry, we're very I'm busy bored. yeah we're up now are we really um, so yeah we're going to go home like I said we're going to list them and then yeah we are hoping to have more content on the YouTube we have got an F80 F80, F80 M3 now, and obviously the CLA 45 shooting break. Um, we haven't put a lot of content out there just yet regarding them, but we will be doing soon. We just haven't had the time recently, and we're also having our house like redecorated and sorted out. So that's also quite interesting, and that's something I do want to vlog for you because everyone's quite interested in houses now. So that's cool. Um, I'm going to leave it here for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it kind of gives you an insight to what is in the Amazon return. Oh,